Hey guys, it's me Erica, and so today I'm going to be showing you how to make these Christmas cards inspired by the anime that is taking everyone by storm, including me, Yuri on Ice. These cards are inspired by the watercolor theme in the intro and have the characters look like they're popping out of the scene. They are super easy to make, so let us get started. So the supplies you will need are cardstock or watercolor paper, watercolor paint, water, paintbrush, scissors, a glue stick, and a sharpie. So first take your cardstock or watercolor paper and cut it to the size you want your card. I wanted to make mine smaller so I just folded the standard paper in half and cut on the line. If you're also wondering, you can't use printer paper for this project because you need a heavier and thicker paper for the paint to not seep through to the other side and actually hold its shape. Then print out the pictures you want to use and cut them out. There will be a link down below for the pictures I used in my video and also make sure to cut them out leaving no white space not cut. Before you start painting, go ahead and position where you want your cutout to be on the card and whether or not you want it to be vertical or horizontal. After that is done, get a cup ready with water and start wetting the card with water. The more wet the paint is, the more lighter the color of the paint will be on the card. For the first card, I'll be doing Yuri's. For his, I use light blue and a hint of pink and yellow. When blending different colors, I suggest wetting the brush after you've got the color on it to dilute the color a bit and make it a bit easier to blend with the contrasting colors. To add more definition to a certain color, use the same color you want to define but not wet it too much so that you can accentuate the sides of the strokes. For Victor's card, I mix blue and purple paint together. And for Yuriyo's card, I decided to mix violet and purple together and make his card vertical. Once the cards are dry, which usually takes about 30 minutes to an hour, take a scrap piece of paper to make the pop-up portion of the card. Cut out a rectangle shape and then fold it into three pieces and attach one side to the cutout and the other side to the card with glue. The bigger the middle section of the scrap piece of paper is, the more prominent the pop-up will become. Then after that, write the words Merry Christmas on the front to complete the card. And of course you don't have to do that because it looks pretty cool the way it is also. Then you're done and now have cool cards to give all your Yuri on Ice friends. It'll probably make them as warm as a Katsudan. <sighs> that sounds really weird to say, but yes, they will be warm inside in a good way. <laughs> if you have any questions, do not be afraid to ask. 
If you try this DIY or the many features on this channel, be sure to use the hashtag ILADIYs on Instagram, Twitter, or Tumblr. Thank you so much, you guys, and see you next time. Bye!